Okay, hey. <laughs> hey, guys. If you're watching this, uh, sorry, I'm not feeling good today, so my voice is going to sound different. You'll probably hear some coughing, gagging, all that stuff. Might have to pause just to go get some drinks, all that stuff. Anyway, today we're going to be reviewing Studio Series Rampage. Now, as you may have guessed, this... Okay, if you've seen the Scrap My Review, you've already known I've had this one for quite some time. Actually got him the day after he was released on Amazon, April 2nd. Anyway, let's... Now, anyway, let's go over his accessories, which I just took off once on no point. The stamp. He has two secret accessories that I will go over in a minute. You guys probably don't know what I'm talking about. Well, you probably do. I'll get to you in a minute. Anyway, here we have his stand, because you can see... Too small. Although, I do gotta admit, this one's movie really accurate. <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna need to. Hang on. How do I get this thing inside? Ow. Wait, why did I say ow? Whatever. Anyway, I'm gonna get more into detail. Anyway, before I go anything else, I just wanna say this was the first Studio Series Constructicon that I have seen. Number 37. And here is his box. <laughs> yes, I still had the box from the day I got him. My mom would not throw it out for some reason. It's as if she knew. I don't know why they were on it for the entire time. Either she's that lazy or she just didn't, or she's that blind. Anyway, back to it, as you can see. Okay, let's put this in the little pack box. But she got a little bit of. Uh, Rampage. Gotta admit here, this one is art like thing. Thirty seven here he's from Transformers and on Juicy's construction rampage. Has wrote to Kara To Kara Tommy. This is like I believe it's one of Hasbro's partners in making Transformer toys. Anyway, Transformers Generations, all that stuff. On the bottom of the box, now we're gonna show I'm not gonna show you. May of Vietnam. That's the only language I can read on here besides this little sentence, and I'm not in the mood. Wait, hold up. That's new. Oh, here's a, it says include figures. Oh, you know. I knew it. That was an accessory. Anyway, on the back of the box, we got big screen inspired stuff. You guys are not looking. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Camera's messed up. Background drop included. Probably movie Optimus Prime here. Pyramid Battle Desert thing. Rampage. Vehicle mode. By the way, fun fact. The vehicle mode on this thing. And all of this colored stuff. Mispronounced. You see this little red peg right here? Yeah, that's gray. See his little hand things right here around his hand and those pistons? Yeah, those are gray. I'm thinking about since I'm here, let's see what other things we can pick up. Comment down below if you see any other differences I might not have pointed out. Anyway, on the, this side of the packaging, here's the Voyager class. On this side of the packaging, just stop, and that's important. And finally, my favorite, Devastator. Yes, apparently now you have this unique label on all Constructicon Studio Series labeling. Instead of that Autobot symbol they usually have there, they'll have Devastator space. And instead of like another picture of a robot, they'll have Devastator here. Pretty cool. And we also have his backdrop. As you can see, his backdrop here, Desert Pyramid Battle. I think was kind of missing some stuff in there. Yeah. Also, I'd like to point out one thing. That shadow back there, that's Devastator. I have a backdrop for Scrap Metal, and they're the exact same shadow. That's how I know. Also, he seems on top of the way. Unless I've seen a thing with Devastator. Most likely did that. Anyway, moving on, back to him. Now, as I said before, he has two secret accessories. I'm gonna go for him. go for them. First of all, these pistons here are detachable, and then you can place them right here. He has a little tab right here on his arm, and another tab right here. And as you can see, the tabs in there. Same for the other side. It's actually quite easy to make a sound. It's actually easier to make a sound. You just pop it in there. 
Not hot at all. There's guns. <laughs> they probably just should put that on the accessories list. <laughs> anyway, you transform into a bulldozer. I'm not going to go into this, but blah, blah, blah. Dang it. Whatever. Anyway, scrap metal. I'm. <laughs> I mean, rampage. I have to point something out here. Versus combiner mode. I'm going to point something out. This point right here. And it says combiner like mode. Yes, if you don't know, he's a leg. Yes, it looks like a thing that Scrap Metal's combiner part could fit into. It does not. I tried it once. It did not work too big. I'm pretty sure it's only specifically designed for overload. Or something like that. <laughs> Either way, whatever. Anyway, I'd also like to say one thing about Hasbro real quick. If you, Hasbro, if you're watching this, do me a favor. Make an Infernicus Studio Series. Seriously, Infernicus. No offense to the hat to your last night, Infernicus. Okay, somewhat offense. It sucks. It just sucks. You look at the power Transformers, Beast Hunters. I think it was that. Uh, Combiner Abominus from Beast Power Transformers Prime Beast Hunters. It's the exact same molded arms and legs. The only difference is he has a sword. But in the movie, he did not have a sword. He only had guns. And also, different thing. Why? Are you guys that cheap? You make these figures. Going down, by the way. Do it. No offense. I don't want to insult you or anything. Please don't sue me. <laughs> but try better for your all your shoes. I'm, I wish you guys would be all toys today. Also, your worst toy line ever. Age of Extinction, by far. Get over it. Anyway. Uh, pay my... <coughs> well, you know, I didn't have to leave. <laughs> Sorry, this was a short review, guys, but I'm not, I don't do transformations, all that stuff. I gotta go. Uh, might as well be a guy. No, I gotta get a drink. Well, see you guys there. Subscribe, like, all that stuff. Yeah. One last look. Sorry about this video. I'm kind of sick today. I'm sorry. Anyway, see you next time.